Hi guys, welcome back to Lainey's Kitchen. Today we're gonna to be making crock pot candy clusters. Because we're gonna be using the crock pot, make sure to have your parent with you. So you need some peanuts. Next, you need some white chocolate. Once you have your peanuts and white chocolate in the crock pot, go ahead and turn it on high. After you've turned on your crock pot, go ahead and stir up everything just a little bit. Once you have everything stirred up, go ahead and put the lid on and wait about 10 minutes. For things in the crock pot, you can get a tray and you can either put some parchment paper down or you can use these little cupcake things and you can line it up on here so that we can put them in this to cool when they're done cooking. All right, so after 10 minutes, you wanna go ahead and stir again. This is what it'll look like. Some things are melting and some things are not. All right, once you've stirred that, go ahead and put the lid back on and wait another 10 minutes. All right, now you wanna go in and stir again and more stuff is gonna be melted. After you stir everything up, go ahead and put the lid back on and wait another 10 minutes. All right, all of your chocolate should be melted and everything should be stirred up. Now we're gonna go ahead and add our M&Ms. Go ahead and take your M&Ms and pour them in here. Once you pour your M&Ms in, Go ahead and stir them into the chocolate. Once everything's stirred up, we're gonna go ahead and get an ice cream scoop and scoop everything from the crock pot onto the cupcake holders. All right, after you've moved it from the crock pot to your cupcake holders, you're gonna go ahead and put it in the freezer for about five to 10 minutes. All right, so after they're out of the freezer, they should be nice and hardened, and you'll be able to just take them out and eat them. And that's how you make crock pot candy clusters. See you next time on Lainey's Kitchen.